Yeah, I mean, if you want to have like a really, really good time on Billy, I would suggest you just use low pro with engravings. It's a bit hard to control, but if you get used to it, it's like really fucking good. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I have the right voice to kind of put people to sleep. She would have made that pallet. Oh, hell yeah. I mean, I'd, I'd say low pro is probably top. I wouldn't be surprised if they nerfed Lopro to how it was when it released. It's it's easily one of his, if not best add-ons. It's fucking busted. If you don't know, when um, when Lopro chains released, it was originally ultra rare, but how it actually functioned was it was literally just speed limiter the whole time. So what they might end up doing to low pro is keeping it purple, but it makes your chainsaw do one health state all the time instead of only after breaking a pallet. That would one million percent um, make the add on way less prevalent. It's a cool add-on, so I hope it stays. I think I'd be okay with that nerf. But... <laughs> I know there would be a lot of people who would be pretty fucking mad. So... I might get a frenzy down, actually. What the fuck is happening, man? What? Oh my god. Oh, you're trolling. You're fucking trolling. I actually missed the fifth hit. Oh my god. I'm gonna fucking delete DVD. <laughs> oh my god, dude. That's rough. Overheat. I I still hold the opin uh, opinion that survivors never actually liked the hillbilly. They just liked that he was bad. Playing killer is stressful. 
I would, if I were you and you're having difficulties playing killer or you feel stressed, I would probably just uh, resort to using just kind of fun chill builds. Play like Drift King Billy, crank up music and just only go for like chainsaw hits. Just get used to playing the game for fun rather than to win. some fun builds for Legion. Pretty much anything revolving around Eerie Button or BFFs. Kick builds with Franks can be fun. Stealth builds with Sunglasses and Ruler are fun. There's some options. Is the basement downstairs? Oh, it is. Yeah, I think some of the most fun I have with Legion is their speed demon build. If they if they actually listen to it, Legion players have to say and make Legion faster. Oh my god. Legion's pick rate will fucking skyrocket. <laughs> I just want to be fast, man. Almost instantly, yeah. But the thing is, he still has to charge his chainsaw. And besides, there's already a bunch of killers who can miss like with very little consequence, like Huntress, for instance. Yeah, survivors just don't like a free win, basically. Oh no, it's an M1 killer who has no chase power. Oh my god, he's so boring, he makes me mend once in a while. Oh my god. That's typically how survivors feel about Legion. Meanwhile, if you ask like literally any good player, they're like, yeah, I fucking love playing against Legion. It's like the most predictable, easy shit on the planet. Just a fun time to loop him. I think the complaints with Legion, at least the ones I read, have always just been mending is like snooze. Which is valid, but there are things in the game that are way more time consuming and boring. Like running across the entire fucking map to search for jigsaw boxes. But no, pig's fun cause haha boop the snoot, lol. Dead meme. Wicked time is on death hook. Slay. Gotta get that value, bro.
Yeah, body and wicked is uh or not wicked, sorry, strength and shadows, yeah. Those two perks are fucking crazy. It's just like the old circle of healing, it's awesome. Reminds me of a better time. A better time where solo key was quite quite fun. The good old days of circle of healing. Why do they nerf circle of healing? Um I think it was just cause uh it was a little insane when you could stack it with a bunch of other things. Like circle of healing, self heal speed, plus a med kit, plus like everything else. It was, it was fucking crazy. I still think the the main problem with old circle of healing was just med kits, but I mean, hey, it's it's done and gone. So who cares at this point? I just want them to make it so that circle of healing works. Um, with medkits for like healing other people, like we'll make it and and botany and such. Cause it's dumb that a healing perk doesn't work with medkits for healing people. That makes absolutely no sense. Like I spend 14 seconds blessing a totem, but I'm not allowed to heal someone else with a medkit in the radius. That just doesn't make sense to me. A pretty pointless downside. Hey, Suki. I feel like Autodidact. It's in a, like a near unbuffable state. Because <laughs> when you actually have tokens, it's like easily one of the best healing perks in the game. But getting tokens is like really inconsistent and hard. Yeah, because the faster you heal someone, the less skill checks you get. Yeah. It's pretty rough. I need to uh, reset the cloud bot because all the links are broken. Thanks for reminding me. Unintentionally, but just using a command. I need to get a stream lapse because it's broken. I for gore. Spine chill. They just over nerfed Spine chill. I think Spine chill's only problem was that it was showing you like stealth killers. But they they went up and but like they went up and beyond and just made it like one of the worst fucking perks in the game. It did not deserve that. Quite literally, all they had to do with Spine Chill is just have the stipulation that it does not work if you're not within the killer's terror radius. Like, that's literally all they had to fucking do. 